Hello everybody, this is the Lysol. Welcome to my week 48 roster update for my main account, the Lysol. Let's get started. So for this project, I put together this spreadsheet to track my gearing. Uh, I break my farms down into four tiers, four to five characters per tier. One character to reach its goal each week and another to get to G12 or G13, depending on what kind of resources I have left within the same week. Uh, I've been working on Leia, Jedi Knight Cal, and Rey. Uh, I'm done with Jedi Knight Cal, I'm done with Jedi Knight Rey, and I am working on Leia. Now, this past week I did not get a lot of progress done, but that is because last week I got an absolutely insane amount of progress done. I got three of my six remaining characters done last week, so I figured I'd have a down week this week, and I did. But I still made a good amount of progress. I've basically gotten over the Cairo hump for the three remaining characters. Uh, I got Scout up to G12, Drogon, and uh, Rex are both at G11. Sorry, I had to get rid of my cat. So due to the changes in the raid structure and gearing and the also just the gear economy changes in general, that has given me a good opportunity to build on my stupid cat, uh, to build on my depth and in my fleets, trying to take characters up to G11, where I view them as minimum usable. Uh, I have this list here, 75 characters. I've generally been able to get about one done per week. Sometimes a little more, sometimes none. Past couple of weeks, I haven't done any, but I have most of the useful ones done, except for some Night Sisters. And then pretty soon, IG-11 and Queel will be done just because of the upcoming uh, Lightspeed Bundle. So I pre-recorded my gearing. Uh, let's look at that. All right, so we start by taking Drogon up to se seven stars, or was that just gear 11? That was gear 11. And then uh, we looked to see what we got for Scout Trooper. He was my goal to this week. I was able to get him to G12, but not to G13. Not the end of the world. Take a look at his abilities. I don't want to spend the Zetas, although with the additive drops coming out next or in two weeks, in a week, give or take, uh, I will probably be able to put his Zeta on and his uh, Omicron. I'm looking at some Ewoks here to kind of bolster my, I'm trying to take the entire, all of the raid requirements up to G12. This is a good excuse, a good reason to take lesser used characters up to G12. So I'm working on some Ewoks. I got Scout up to 11. I got Tebow here up to nine. Let me take a look here at the Stormtrooper I think is next. And I do take Stormtrooper up to gear 12. So I've got some improvement on like my Iden team, my Ewoks. Oh, I do take low gray up to G12 as well. Uh, I think that's it. Yeah, I, I'm out of Carbontes. All right, so tracking my progress from last week to this week, uh, we went from seven or from 10.072 million GP to 10.083. That's only 11,000. That's a pretty light week. Uh, Zetas stayed the same at 221. Omicron stayed the same at 26. G13s also stayed the same at 150. I did get three more G12s, so I'm at 16. And I lost a G11, putting me at 41. So next week, we're trying to get Scout Trooper done. We talked about this last week. He requires two sets of security scanners. And that's the only thing he requires two sets of, so it should be pretty easy for me to gear. Uh, he does require the shock prods, though, so I need to make sure I have 100 more of those this coming week than I do of the battle computers, which shouldn't be a problem. I'm putting a ton of energy into the uh, shock prods. So for next week, my plan is dark side, light side, Kairos. And since I made the graphic, uh, Paz Vizsla has been put on light side 4a i believe uh so i've been putting two refreshes into him he's the only character i have yet to finish that is available to farm it's nice being caught up i'll tell you that uh cantina we're doing signal data fleet we're doing med pack security scanners and hypo syringes 
had I not been able to get my uh, Marauder up to seven stars during the chase, I would also be working on that, but I do not need to, which is nice. So my goal for next week is to have an R7 Scout or Rex, a G12 Drogan, and another couple of troopers or Ewoks at G12 for the raid. Anyway, that's it for today, guys. I appreciate you coming by and watching, and I will see you guys in week 49. Peace out. Thanks for watching. If you liked what you saw, be sure to like, subscribe, comment in the comment section down below, and you can join me on Twitch or Discord. Both have links in the description. I hope to see you guys there.